Hello, today we're reading Lest We Forget by Kerry Brown, illustrated by Isabel Knowles and Benjamin Portis. My granddad says there are two types of days, those you want to remember and those you want to forget. I remember my first day of school. I had a brand new uniform and mum polished my shoes until I could see my face in them. I was a little bit scared, but mum said I had to stand tall because I was her brave little soldier. I remember playing soccer on the weekends with my team. We trained really hard. Sometimes we won and sometimes we lost. Our coach said that we were like a family and it was important for us to look after each other on the field. I remember when my baby sister was born. Mum and Dad had a celebration. All of our friends arrived with presents and plates of food. Everyone sang and danced late into the night. I would like to forget the day mum tried to make stuffed pork. She burnt the roast and the whole house filled up with smoke. We had to eat Vegemite sandwiches for dinner. I would like to forget the day Dad's truck got a flat tire. I had to walk all the way to school. The sun was scorching hot and my bag was so heavy. I would like to forget the day the vet rang to say our dog had died. Dad helped me make her a special goodbye bed in the backyard. Sometimes when I visit Grandad, we talk about our days. Grandad's stories are always interesting, and he thinks mine are funny. Grandad says that out of all the days of the year, there are two that are very important. He says that they are the days that make the country stand still, and they are the days that make him sad. I asked Grandad if these are the days he would like to forget. He looked at me and said, no son, these are the days where we must stop and remember. Lest we forget. And that's the end of this very important story, Lest We Forget. Written by Kerry Brown, illustrated by Isabel Knowles and Benjamin Portis.